So this question says, a shape is made of six triangles. Each triangle is exactly the same size. If one triangle has a height of 10 feet and a base of six feet, what is the total area in square feet of the shape? So we know we have some shape and this shape has six triangles that make it up. Each triangle is exactly the same size. If you have triangles that are the same size, it means they'll have equal areas. In the next sentence, they tell us everything we need to know about one of the triangles. So we have a triangle, and this triangle has a height of 10 feet and a base of 6 feet. So now that we have the base and height for one triangle, we can find the area of that triangle. But remember, not all area formulas are the same. So we have to make sure we start off with the right formula. And since we have a triangle, the formula is base times height divided by two. So we have the base of this triangle, which is six feet. So wherever I see the B, I'm gonna put six. So right next to this, I'll write the equal sign. My base is six feet, so I'll write that here. Times my height, which is 10 feet. So I'll put 10 feet here. All of that divided by two. So we've got six feet times 10 feet. Six times 10 equals 60. And feet times feet is what gives us feet squared. And we still have to bring down this line and the two because we haven't used it yet. So we'll put this line here and then the two. So now we've got 60 square feet divided by two. And that equals, what do you think? Well, 60 divided by 2 is 30, so that will be 30 feet squared. Now, what exactly is that? That's the area of just one triangle. And that might look something like this. But remember, that's only one triangle, and our shape is made up of six triangles. So what do you think we'll have to do to this 30? Hmm. If you said multiply by 6, you're absolutely right. <laughs> so let's do that work over here. I also want to make sure that this work is as detailed as possible. So I'm going to write down 30. And I'm also going to write down what it represents. and I'm multiplying that by six. Where six is the number of triangles in this shape. Six times zero is zero. And six times three is 18. Which means that the total area of this shape is 180 feet squared. So this is our final answer, but I also want to take a second to show you what that would look like. Remember, each triangle has an area of 30 square feet, and our shape has six triangles in it. So it might look something like this. Here's the first triangle in the shape, the second triangle, the third triangle, the fourth triangle, the fifth triangle, and the sixth triangle. You might have something that looks different, but it doesn't matter because they all have the same area. But if I added up all these 30s, I would end up with a shape that has a total area of 180 square feet. And there you have it, our final answer. 
Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on the Math Review.